Hey guys, Stefan here from ProjectLifeMastery.com. I'm here with my friend Wade Lightheart again in part two of this interview. And in this part, we want to focus in on supplement supplementation, but more specifically, the optimizers that we referenced as part of the awesome health formula. And if you missed that, by the way, I'd, re I'd recommend you go back to the previous uh, video interview where you shared your awesome formula. But uh, in terms of optimizers, we talked a lot about that, but I want to specifically zoom in on uh, the enzymes and probiotics. Mm -hmm. And you founded a great company, uh, BioOptimizers. You guys have these masszymes here, which are digestive enzymes. I've been taking them for years. Have helped me increase my muscle mass, uh, digest my food better, have more energy. And then also, you guys have here your probiotics, P3OM right here as well. So do you want to talk a little bit before we, you know, share a little bit about these, uh, just the importance of enzymes, probiotics, and then jump into the products here? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, this was, this was probably the biggest breakthrough I made in holistic health and in high performance because um, recognize the only thing that does work in your body is enzymes and probiotics. So what they are is enzymes are little catalysts that take one thing and convert it into something else. And anything that you wanna do, whether it's thinking or blinking, requires an enzyme. And if you read a book by a fellow by the name of Dr. Edward Howell, he wrote uh, Enzyme Nutrition and, and Food Enzymes for a Health and Longevity. He determined that the average 40-year-old has less than 30% of the enzymes. That was in the 40s or 50s. It's probably much less today. He also determined that the link of lifespan of any biological organism was determined by the amount of enzymes or what he called the enzyme potential. So myself, I was looking at, well, geez, we can't get more enzymes from food. So if I eat food, even if it's raw food, it's only enough enzymes to digest the food. I was like, how do I build up my bank account? How do I become an enzyme billionaire, if you will, so that I could write more of these metabolic checks, whether that was building muscle, thinking clearer, sleeping less, recovering faster, you know, what are those things? And I started studying enzymes and enzyme therapy and I'd heard these miraculous cases of people overcoming serious illness using massive amounts of enzymes and it turned out, and then, and then also the role of probiotics because in the last 40 years, or last 60 years, I guess, we've, we've had such a proliferation of the use of antibiotics. So probiotics, what they do is those are like little, little tiny organisms that are essential to digesting your food, they, they, your immune system, even like if you get inflammation, probiotics control how much inflammation happens and how it reduces. Like bacteria, there's 10 times the amount of bacteria in your body than you have cells. Mm -hmm. So it's almost like we're like mushrooms that are running, the bacteria running us. And 10% of these are good and 10% of these bad. And 80% are opportunists based on diet, lifestyle, environment we talked about in the awesome formula about stress. And so in the world today, we've taken a lot of antibiotics, we cook food, we pasteurize it. This wipes out the enzymes and it wipes out the good bacteria. So probiotics are good bacteria. So going back to the enzymes, we'll deal with that first because they work mm -hmm. hand in hand. They're symbiotic. They're the only things that do work in the body. When you're looking at enzymes, you'll go, why do I need this? Well, when you take any food in, your body has to manufacture enzymes in order to build it. So it's going to take that out of taking muscle tissue and converting it into enzymes to digest your food. And we know that the aging process, for example, you lose about 1% muscle a year. Well, why is that? It's simply because you're digesting yourself to digest your food. And if you're not replacing that, eventually you get to compromised health. It could be liver problem for someone else, right. it could be muscle mass. So many of us, we have a reserve of these yes. enzymes, but we're using that reserve to digest foods which are deficient in enzymes like meat and dairy or whatever other foods that you're ingesting. And as you use that deficiency, that reserve, then you lose muscle mass and what else, what else happens to the body? Well, your ability to think, right. you know, so clarity of thinking, brain fog. Um, your ability to, your sleeping time, you sleep more, um, recovery, but your ability to lose weight, okay, to have a lot of energy, um, to regenerate your liver. So for example, a lot of people in their 20s, they can go out partying all night, get up the next day and go to work. They get to their 30s and like, oh, I can't do that. By the time they're 40, they're like, no way can I do that. Well, that's because of the enzymatic potential of your tw at 20 to 40. So if you're looking at long-term health, I said, well, 
how do I pump more enzymes into if I can't just right. get enough from my food? That's when supplemental enzymes, but then again, those aren't created equal. So if you go to the store shelf, you can get enzymes with protease, amylase, lipase, all these sort of things, you know, for 10 or 15 or 20 bucks. Yeah. That doesn't mean it's a good product, right. okay? Or you can go to a medical facility where they're producing something like this, like a medical grade, which is hundreds of dollars mm -hmm. for an enzyme, which looks the same on the surface if you're not educated. Mm -hmm. So what is a person looking for, I guess, it would come to is mm -hmm. when you're looking at enzymes is there's three main enzymes that you, amylase, lipase, and protease. Mm -hmm. And out of those enzymes, amylase digests carbohydrates, lipase digests fats, protease digest proteins. Now what's interesting, if you take them independently without digestion, we've noticed that they have benefits for those enzymatic reactions in the body. So for example, people with skin conditions, lots of times they take lipase and their skin conditions improve. Yeah. Uh, people that have uh, diabetes and things like that, they'll take amylase and they don't need as much insulin. Right. And people who are maybe depressed and that sort of stuff, they start taking protease and all of a sudden, they're able to make the polypeptide change and they feel happier. Mm -hmm. And I believe that's because of the enzymatic pathways. That's anecdotal evidence, but there's a lot of supporting anecdotal evidence around that. So what you want is primarily the one that people lose the most is protease. Right. Proteins, we have a high protein-based diet as a society. And so I think we put more of a drain on proteases. And then of course, undigested food gets, undigested protein particularly, that becomes a source of food for bad bacteria. So it contributes to the proliferation of bad bacteria and candida and all these things that people are suffering from. So first and foremost, you wanna get a multi-stage protease that has the amylase and lipase and all the precursors that go with it that is usable by the body, that's plant-based, so it works in a pH range right. uh, of wide, animal-based uh, enzymes that they take from pancreas of, of pigs or cattle or whatever. They only have a very limited range where a plant-based enzyme has a longer range. You want it stabilized without any chemicals. You don't want right. the magnesium stearates and the dioxides and all that stuff. You want a, a like a rice bran protein or something right. like that that stabilizes the enzyme. Mm -hmm. So you don't have all those chemicals. Uh, we use plant-based uh, capsules without gelatin. So people who are plant-based people, they don't right. have to worry about that sort of thing yeah. as well. And then we create it with a very, very high emphasis on protease. We actually have five different proteases and a three stage 3.0, 4.5, 6.0. So we are cleaving the essential amino acids at every stage of digestion. If you want to ask about the digestion, go back to the other video and we kind of yep. break down to how that works. So that's what we put together here because as a plant-based guy, I wanted to know how I put on more muscle yeah. eating, you know, I'm probably the only guy that's competed at the world championships eating 85 grams of protein a day. Yeah. And most guys in my competitors are eating 250, yeah. 300, 400. I'm eating 85 and I'm beating them. You know, so how did that happen? Well, this is how it happened. Yeah, yeah and I, I can attest to that because I started taking this product years ago. You've had this for how many years now? Uh, we started the first version of that was in 2005. Wow. Yeah, and so I, I mean, you, you guys have raving fan customers. I've been a raving fan as well, just taking this. I mean, I take enzyme, uh, the mass signs with every meal that I have. I take them on an empty stomach. It's helped me put on more muscle, absorb more of the, uh, the protein from my foods as well, so I've needed less. But I think more than that, like a, another huge benefit has just been the energy because any food that you're consuming, your body has to digest it. It has to use energy to digest that food. This speeds up the digestion process. You guys have an awesome video on your, your website, which I'll reference to later as well, that shows the power of these mass signs breaking down oatmeal and meat and all yeah. types of, uh, of foods right there before your eyes, which is pretty powerful. But I found that anytime I eat, eat you know, even if it's a bad meal or whatever. You yeah, know, well, they're you great know. for bad yeah, meals. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it can help uh, just reduce the effect of, you know, feeling bloated or sick or tired or whatever it is. So this has helped me have way more energy while at the same time putting on, on a lot of muscle too. Yeah, and it really helped, like you said something really powerful, the, 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 the bad meal syndrome. Yeah. And, you know, I, I don't want to say that I'm like, a perfect, you know, I've we done all these bad meals. Yeah, we all have those meals that yeah. probably aren't the best for us, and you kind of get that bloated. I just like grab a handful of these things, and I'm just like, okay, yeah. done. Yeah, yum. You know, and I wash it down with some water. You know. Yeah. 
And that's it. You know, a few minutes later, bloating's gone. Yeah. Don't have that feeling. Don't have that sick feeling in your stomach. Yeah. Like, wow, this is powerful. Yeah. Like that you can have, you can literally alter people, your digestive People efficiency. don't realize that when you eat something, your body, especially certain foods that maybe are incompatible with your body, your body's spending hours breaking it down oh, and trying to digest it, using energy to digest that food. They say that digestion is like the number two uh, expenditure of energy and sex is like number one, but digestion, it requires so much energy to break down food. Well, I, you know, I use the turkey dinner syndrome. Right. Everybody's kind of had, you know, the, the turkey dinner, the family's around and everybody's loading up the helping with all the stuff. And then right after you see everybody making the dash for the yeah. couch and the floor and the drools coming down yeah, their yeah. face and everything. Well, why is that happening? Because you've eaten so much food yeah. that the body is like, it doesn't have enough enzymes to run its brain. It doesn't have the enzymes. That, so what it does, it puts you in a sleep state. Mm -hmm. You've got all this blood sugar going into the body. It can't manage that. It can't manage what's hitting the brain. So it shuts you down. You fall asleep. It takes all the metabolic enzymes, starts committing digestive enzymes to deal with this. Stuff, and then you wake up a little bit ever kind of groggy. And what are you? You're hungry. Yeah. And the reason you're hungry is you took key amino acids out of your smooth muscle tissue. Uh -huh. Your body's diminished that and it's like, I gotta replace these amino acids because mm -hmm. it converted those into enzymes. This is how you avoid this. So you can have two, three, four helpings at a turkey dinner yeah. Yeah. and you're fine. Yeah. Not that I'm recommending that. But. So, you, so you take this with your meals, right? Yes. Like I usually take four to five with yeah. each meal. Uh, what's the benefit of taking them on an empty stomach? Well, what we found is when your body, if you check stool, your body will not willingly give up enzymes. It'll right. use them in the body, but it doesn't like excrete it. Like if you take too much vitamin C, it'll go out of the body, or too much vitamin D or E, you'll get the runs. Okay, but with enzymes, you don't find this. I've taken up to a thousand a day. Wow. Yeah, just just to test it. I'm not saying you do that, but you know, I, I put things to the test. What we found is now that gets converted into the metabolic pathways that you require. And some people, this is a controversial subject, but I can tell you this. Clinical experience trumps everything. And I've had so many cases of clients who've had various conditions that had an enzyme, like we talk about skin conditions, we talk about people with depression, we talk about people with blood sugar issues, taking these on an empty stomach a couple times a day, and all of a sudden, these things start to go away. Mm -hmm. And you know, I remember I, we had a, the raw food expo, and a guy had a skin condition, and he started taking him, and he started feeling it. I had a, a, a friend of mine; she had a major necrosis scar here, right, from a spider bite, and had about, about this thick. And she, this was—I remember being so surprised myself. She'd take five of these mass signs, and within five or ten minutes, this got red, this scar, and got itchy. Now she continued on that process for several years and now the scar is completely smooth it's wow. broken down that old scar tissue and it's right. now smooth and thing and she's got full range of motion in her shoulder that she didn't have before wow and that's right because it's going directly to the moment. you'll get some of that from regular stuff but if you add to it the other thing before workouts i do this before a workout i get a way better yep. boost in my training than right. if i than if i don't it accelerates fat loss it increases training focus and drive, and then it primes me, I think, to have a better workout because again, it's, it all comes down to the workers. Yeah, so people, let's say, that have you know, abused themselves, they've eaten a lot of cooked food, uh, foods that are deficient in enzymes, they're using that reserve. When they start taking mass signs, how have you noticed, you know, how long does it take to build up that, build back that reserve? Great uh, question. Yeah. That's a, that's a great question, and, and here's what I found. You gotta realize that, you know, this is what I call it's not a quick fix, but there's no ceiling on it. That's the cool thing. So there's, you go through what I call three stages in biological optimization. There is the assimilation stage. So what you'll notice initially is that you improve, you don't get the bloating, you don't get the digestive. That's a pretty much a noticeable thing, okay? Uh, when you're eating your food. So you increase your ability to assimilate. Second level, you start to get more out of your food. So what I call the nutrification stage. And in the nutrification stage, what happens is 
You start absorbing more food so people start to notice I'm not as hungry as I used to be. I can go longer without being tired. So maybe I, you know, I'd be filming all day, you might go four or five hours without eating. Mm -hmm. You don't feel bad anymore, you're not crashing, you have sustained energy levels. Yeah. And then the third level is optimization. And that's when you really start to notice taking your enzymes or what foods work, you, you're an enhanced intuitive nature mm -hmm. again. You reactivate what I call as our natural innate nature or innate wisdom. And that usually takes about 90 days. Mm -hmm. So you'll notice some results relatively soon and then it just keeps getting better. And like I said, we've had people literally have been using this product religiously for 10 years. Yeah. Yeah. You know, like they're still on it. They're still getting it every month. Yeah. They're still raving about it. They're like, they're so happy they had it. And yeah, and I think that's what they, makes me feel good. The cool right? thing, I think on your website too, you have some fitness transformations of people taking these products as well. So not just, I think with energy and health, but the, the fitness side, if you're someone that works out and you want to get better results in the gym, yeah. you know, Mass Signs has been one of the best things. The, let's jump to the probiotics. You yeah. Know, uh, do you want to talk a little bit, just the benefit of probiotics and about this product here? Well, you know, so again, going back to your probiotic levels, there's about 500 different strains of probiotics in your body mm -hmm. on average. Um, there's 10 good, 10 bad, 80% opportunists. And your diet, your lifestyle, and everything contribute to that. Now, in the modern world over the last 60, 70 years, we've developed a massive amount of antibiotics. We're antibiotic this, and we've wiped out a lot of the good flora. If you take an antibiotic, you wipe out good, bad, ugly, everybody gets, it's like bombing that. But the thing is with our diets, it's so much easier for bad bacteria to proliferate because we have all these foods that we've never had before as humans. So we haven't adapted biologically as quick as we've developed all these commercial food products that we haven't had before, which seem to create more prol proliferation of bad bacteria. And what happens, people get into the cycle of antibiotics, but they never get back into dietary balance, mm -hmm. where they have that optimal mm -hmm. bacteria culture that they can assimilate foods, they can fight off immune system, they can fight off foreign invaders. Mm -hmm. So now what you're seeing is there's a massive push for taking probiotics, which is a great thing. Mm -hmm. And there's a variety of strains that started having, the original research showed Bulgarian peasants that lived, they had a higher life expectancy. They were all living to be like 100 years old. And they realized that they made a special probiotic kefir. They would eat this in the night, in the morning, it had to be fresh. And mm -hmm. they lived a long time because they had better immune systems. Well, now we have all these different bacteria and people competing to it. So, but we also have super bacteria, super bad bacteria. You go MRSA, E. coli, that are now are, are antibiotic resistant mm -hmm. strains that are in hospitals. Right. So we looked at it like, well, now there's super bad bacteria instead of just regular bacteria that are resistant to antibiotics. We can't wipe them out that way. We have dietary habits. How do we make a super bacteria? How do we make a super good bacteria? Mm -hmm. So what we did is we went out. Now, we got a bacteria strain where we took a, a, a very common, hardy, aggressive strain. What do we mean by aggressive? A strain that will wipe out bad bacteria, that'll wipe out other foreign invaders and things in your immune system. We took that strain and the doctor that developed this, what he did is he put it through like a, imagine it going through a Navy SEALs camp. Mm -hmm. in, 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 you can read the patent information of what they subjected this strain of bacteria through and to make it a super bacteria. And unlike a, a strain that just sits in your digestive system, this goes through the whole body. Mm -hmm. It goes into your blood, into your brain, it goes everywhere and it wipes out undigested protein. And in the US patent, it talks about this in, you know, I'm, I'm not making these claims, I'm not making any claims here, but in the US patent, you can Google it online when you go to your stuff, it's antibacterial, it's antiviral, antiretroviral, it's antimicrobial and antitumoral. And these products also, I think, was a big contributor. It helped me um, work with cancer. And now I'm an advisor for the American Anti-Cancer Institute. We help support people's uh, functions. Mm -hmm. and we, we, we don't cure cancer, I wanna be clear about that, but what we do is we show people what you can do to support your immune system, support your digestive system, so that you can live in an optimal level and give yourself the best chance of recovery. But more importantly, I think it's more important to get it to prevent right. those things from happening. Because yeah. you don't get cancer all of a sudden. You don't get obesity all of a sudden. Mm -hmm. You don't get low energy all of a sudden. There's a tipping point that one day you feel that. So if you're in one of those situations, you know these are probably the ways to first get your digestive health back, 
because that's gonna make it easier to do your diet. That's gonna make it easier to do your training. That's gonna give you more energy so you're not reaching for the things that we don't, that aren't good for us. And from there, we can kind of start optimizing our diet and become simpler, faster, easier, more efficient. But the, the really cool thing is, we haven't found a ceiling on this. Right. It just seems to keep getting better. Yeah. And uh, I, I feel really grateful and I'm happy to share it with everybody that I can. And you know, the beauty about one of the things that we're so confident about is unlike most companies where you'll buy something on the shelf or something like that, mm. we do full 60 day guarantees. Why? Okay, not 30 days, 60. Look, we yeah. want you to be taking this a long enough time that it becomes self-evident that, hey Wade, this stuff is really, really working. And if for some reason you, you weren't having that effect, we want to have the person's money back. So there's no risk when somebody takes it because there's nothing worse than, than paying for a product that doesn't work. Yeah. So we take we remove all the risk with that because we're so confident in how yeah. well it works. That's really cool. So there's obviously different types of probiotics. Yes. A lot of people might think, you know, I should just eat yogurt or something like that right. to get my probiotics. So why is it beneficial to supplement because uh, you know, there's obviously a lot of different types of probiotics as well. That's a great question, and, and I'm, I'm going to take people down to a really deeper level. The, the, the deep down secret they won't tell you about in probiotics. Yeah. And what that is is this: is when you produce a probiotic, first and foremost, you're going to look on the back, and it's going to say it has this many count, like you know, CFU. Like, mm -hmm. okay, we have this amount. What that tells you, in depending on where the, it's manufactured, it'll show you how much is put into the bottle at time of manufacturing. If it's in a yogurt or something like that, it's a store, the chances are that that got pasteurized before it got to your door. There's nothing in it, but there was that much of the count. So now in some manufacturing standards are catching on and they'll say, well, what is the count one year later? Because you don't know how long it's been mm -hmm. since that happened. Mm -hmm. So it'll say there's the manufacturing count, but then you'll notice there's a reduced count. Right. So it'll be smaller than you think. Right. So that's how much they know is gonna be a year. You're probably getting more if it was direct to the consumer. Like when we put our stuff, we ship it directly to the consumer. There's no right. store, there's no, like, there's no yeah. wait time. Yeah. So we know that the count is very, very high. Right. The, other thing is, the other thing is is we freeze dry it. Right. So that, it, and it's stabilized in a, in a in a, in, a, in a natural molecule, okay, with the rice bran protein, there's no chemicals or anything. Mm -hmm. So it's, it's waiting to be activated. Now, when, as soon as you put it in your body, boom, now it becomes activated. And what's really amazing about this is that this has a doubling effect of about every 20 minutes. Right. So it, let's say you put a billion inside your body, 20 minutes later, that's two billion. Wow. 20 minutes later, it's four billion. 20 minutes later, it's eight billion. Right. So there's one of the effects because it's gone through that that training for, for the, they, they just go in and start replicating yeah. much faster than say if you're using just a straight like you know bifidus or acidophilus or mm -hmm. bulgaricus or some of the more popular brands not saying that those brands aren't great because mm -hmm. a lot of them really are um, but you want to have freeze dried you want to have it stabilized in a capsule you don't want any chemicals like the stearates and dioxides and things yeah. you can't pronounce Okay, um, you want, if you can, have it shipped directly to your house as opposed to going through the stores because you don't know how long that might be. Mm -hmm. And then you want to be able to take, like we take these, um, the best time is just before you go to bed. Right. And the reason being is that's going to go doubling inside right. your blood and your system. So while you're sleeping, these guys are cleaning out all the garbage from the day. And another time is, let's say you're traveling, mm -hmm. I do recommend that you take a little bit before your meals. Be, or you're going to eat at a restaurant or places where you can't control where you might getting like mm -hmm. bacteria mm -hmm. or like you no know, bad bacteria. Take these beforehand, and it becomes just such a great protection because you know that these are going to wipe out those potentially you know bacteria that are going to make you sick. And mm -hmm. we've had some situations where people are literally on the floor, wow. like in in it, with food poisoning and it's super painful. And we just take a handful of both of these, and within 15 yeah. minutes. They're feeling better. Wow, that's awesome. Yeah. And again, again, we'll have a link to the website because on the website there's that awesome video that I think Matt does uh, showing the power of these digesting yeah. food, uh, which is pretty amazing. Now, there's a lot of different types of enzymes, probiotics out there in the market. You've been in the supplement industry for a long, long time. Do you want to talk a little bit about that? Because 
you know, one thing that's kind of frustrating in the supplement industry is, you know, you see certain products and people, hey, enzymes, probiotics, and I heard that in a video, I'm gonna go buy the stuff on the shelf that's $10, right. but they're really doing themselves a disservice uh, by going after the products that are really inexpensive like that just because the quality has been compromised on a big scale. So do you want to, you know, your, your products here are, are the highest quality that can be, but they're obviously a little bit more expensive than what you're going to find on the store shelf. So do you want to talk a little bit about that? Yeah, absolutely. It's a big thing. And, you know, as you said, I've been in the supplement industry from every level, from owning my own store to be repping products, to be a sponsored athlete to manufacturing, design, distribution. So I, I understand every single level where the advantages and disadvantages are. And what I can tell you is there's always going to be, whenever anything comes out, new discovery in any product, whether it's a protein, whether it's an enzyme or a probiotic, what happens is researchers will make a breakthrough, they've got a great probiotic or whatever, and, they, and, then, they, and then you have the highest level that's being produced at what I call a medical grade, which is what we produce. And then there's a whole bunch of what I call piggybacks that kind of come off and yeah, they, they take the science and the research yeah. and they show it on their website. So it looks like you have the same one, mm -hmm. but you don't know that. Like what it does, it, it, it's creating and framing the information in a way that doesn't give you the consumer the whole picture. And frankly, if you're not in the industry, it'd be very difficult for you to figure this out on your own. I happen to be in it and you know, I mean, I was turned off from a, a big corporate company that probably everybody knows that produces specialized books and they're out everywhere. They hired me to develop a fat burning product and then I literally went out to the places where they manufactured and stuff like that and then I came back to the boardroom and they, I mean, it was a complete masquerade of what they were going to do and I opted out of that even though it was going to be millions of bucks for me. Mm -hmm. I, I just couldn't do it because you know, I had bought those products that sucked, that the magazine article looked great or look, you know, I thought, I thought that was it. You know, this is, and you know, there was the guy or the girl having it. I'm like, I'm going to get the result and I'm excited and I put my 20 or 50 or 100 bucks in and I got nothing. Yeah. And, and the reason because, it wasn't because the technology was wrong, is the product was borrowing and making it look like it was the same and it wasn't. Mm -hmm. And like, just for example, if you look at the enzymes, mm -hmm. you'll see enzymes that'll say protease and amylase and lipase but there's no determining of what's the quality of that. Mm -hmm. And there's all these weird things that are gonna do it. That's why we do the 60 day money back guarantee. Right. After 60 days, if you haven't noticed in a beneficial aspect, we demand that we get your money back because we're so confident about that. And whenever you're shopping, you wanna ask that from your store. You're spending your hard earned money. You're taking that. There's nothing more expensive than a product that doesn't work. Yeah. Nothing. Yeah. So you want to ask that person at the store, hey, is there a money back guarantee on this over 60 days? Mm -hmm. Will they give that to you? Mm -hmm. And if that person's not willing to do that, you might want to think again. Yeah. Because, you know, one of the things about your coaching or courses and stuff, you, you're confident in what it does if people yeah. do the work. Yeah. And you offer money back to, hey, if you don't work for it, yeah. take your money back. You don't yeah. want that. Yeah. We do the same thing here. And I think that's the biggest test. And don't be afraid to exercise that, you know, and, and I'm, I can't be more emphasis on that. And far as uh, probiotics, this is becoming the rage. You go into the Whole Foods and all this stuff, you see all these different probiotics. And again, recognize that when you're purchasing from a retail and store environment, the cost is, is being, there's a lot of different factors. There's the shipping to the company, there's the distributor, there's the store that's distributing the information, there's the employees, there's the warehousing, there's all these things that are factored into the cost of your $20 bottle, mm -hmm. of your $40 bottle, your $50 bottle. So whatever that you're spending, there's a big chunk that's going to handle all of that stuff. Mm -hmm. We don't do that. It's right. direct right to you. So we cut all that so we can produce a higher quality product at a lower price. And even then, we're selling, our, our, our products are not inexpensive, okay? Right. I wanna be clear about this. But what you can say is you're getting a medical grade something that works. Yeah. So you need less, you get more, and it works. Yeah, and always invest in the best. I mean, I, I'm the same way with all the products that I get. You know, I, I make sure it's a great source. The company has integrity. They put quality first and foremost. 
Because a lot of these companies, you know, they spend all their money on marketing and advertising. In order to sell a product in the store, you have to, you know, lower the quality and price just enough to be able to compete with all the other products there as well. So, uh, you know, I stand behind the mass signs, the probiotics that Wade offers here. We'll have links to them so you guys can check out the website, see the video demonstration that I'm talking about and learn more. Let's uh, just talk a little bit real quick about these other products that you guys have, which I've been taking as well, which are the liquid uh, multivitamins and the liquid minerals. So t tell us a little bit about this. This is probably one of our most exciting products out there because if you look at vitamins and minerals and, and, and understand and delivery, there's something that's really important. And in order for you to assimilate any vitamin or mineral, you need what's called fulvic acid. Fulvic acid is an acid and, and humic acid are produced by the plant in order to convert inorganic compounds into organic compounds that our body can use. And without that, so if you're eating ground up rocks, you're not getting anything. So, right. you know, calcium, these hard pills, Forget it, you're wasting your money, it's going down the drain, your medical doctor's probably right. Mm -hmm. Okay, the physician death reference guide says I think 87% or 85% of that goes down the drain, you don't utilize it. Right. So second, let, so that's old news. Then you go to powders and stuff like that, and some of them are pretty good. Mm -hmm. And you know, a lot of people like green powders, and I'm an advocate of that. But how do you get the most amount of vitamins and minerals in the most cost-effective way. And not just the main ones, not the ones you hear about the vitamin E's and B's and all that stuff. We're talking about the trace minerals, the little elements that make all of your DNA interactions better, that make the, your thoughts sharper, your cells run up quicker. Mm -hmm. And we've been able to do that by creating a fulvic acid, humic acid delivery system for vitamins and minerals with all the trace minerals and all of the vitamins. So there's over 83 vitamins and minerals inside this combination. And so what that does, and by compressing it into a liquid suspension, we're able to give you your entire dosage of vitamins and minerals in seven drops. So now we've got a convenient dropper format. Yeah. The best part is we also can go dose, dose specific. Mm -hmm. So for example, if you're taking pills and stuff, and I mean, it only makes sense. A 300 pound lineman mm -hmm. is not going, is going to have a different vitamin requirement than a 90 pound grandmother. Right. So what we've done is we've taken this and we've built it so that for every 10 kilos or 20, roughly 20 pounds, you take one drop. Right. So if you're 160 pounds, right. okay, you're gonna take eight drops of yeah. this vitamin or mineral and yeah. same thing for the other one. So now, and you're also able to separate vitamins and minerals because right. some people will find they like a little bit more min yeah. minerals. Some people need a little bit more energy so they want more of the benefits of the bees. It's simple, it's easy, easy it's convenient, it can go on planes. Yeah. You just drop it in your water, it tastes great, no yeah. weird taste. It's so easy and convenient right. and what people are raving about is when they take these vitamins and minerals, they're just not hungry. Yeah. So they're able to sustain high levels of energy without getting food and that's where we go back to the awesome formula. And that is about getting the electrons, getting yeah. the energy out of life, out of your water, out of your oxygen, out of the food you're eating and having nice sustained levels of energy. And the best part is, is like, it's so inexpensive, it's like yeah. 50 bucks yeah. for a month's supply yeah. and you're, you know that you're spending time, energy and money on something that's gonna deliver and again, 60 day guarantee. Awesome. So some people are doing, yeah. you know, they do the whole stack. Right. You know, they go, okay, wait, I'm all, you know, or Stefan, I'm yeah. all in, yeah. what do I need to do? You, you do this, you go to the site, you click on one, as soon as you select one, you'll have the option of going to the next one and the next one you get the whole stack. Right. Do it for 30, 60, 90 days. Let us know what's happening, and I yeah. can guarantee this. You're gonna feel amazing. Yeah. You're gonna like you're gonna go like, I feel like I could run through walls yeah. and I get these testimonials and you know some of the who's who in the industry have embraced this and, and I, I'm just so grateful for it. You know? Yeah, no, that's awesome. So one thing I want to ask about as well, the reason also the liquid form, I think you mentioned to me at another point is uh, when you Take it in liquid, you can put it under your tongue and you get even better absorption. Do That's you right. Talk about that. Yeah, so uh, so the technical term is what we have to say in this FDA world is I can't tell you to put it under your tongue because then it'd be classified as a drug. Okay. <laughs> it's not a drug. But what I do say is you can put a few drops in your mouth. And then from there, just let it sit there for a little bit and see what happens. Yeah. 
for you. Um, I can't say under the tongue, that's an FD regulation, okay. but if it happens to go under your tongue, well, I can't control that, but just put it in your mouth and hold it and see what happens. And of course, uh, you know, the results will speak for, its, for yourself. Right, cool, yeah. cool. <laughs> awesome, well, I, I've been taking these products, I mean, the mass signs and the probiotics for a number of years now. Uh, these ones, the, the, the vitamins and minerals, I'm really happy you guys came out with those because I've, uh, you know, I, I, it's hard to find good quality products. I'm always asking around of different people, friends, and you're someone that, I mean, I go to you for coaching for this because I know that you, whatever goes into your body is the best. Yeah. You know, he's the optimization guy. So I can trust anything that you say because you've spent the years in the industry trying this, trying that. A lot of money. Yeah, <laughs> a, lot of, a money. lot of money as well. So, <laughs> Half you know, a million I, dollars at least. Yeah, so rather than trying to buy whatever the magazine tells you or whatever you, you know, looks cool in the store or whatever, I'd much rather just get what works uh, from the best company out there and uh, what you guys are producing is pretty amazing. So uh, we'll have links to all these different products. Uh, check out the additional videos and, and learn more about them. Uh, but I want to thank you guys for watching this video. Thank you, Wade, and we'll talk to you soon. Hey, great to be here.